Hello, this is Onyx Tarot, and today I'm going to be doing a collective message, so any and all zodiac signs, okay? So thank you guys so much for hitting the like button, subscribing, I really do appreciate it. So let's go ahead and get a message for the collective, any and all zodiac signs. Okay, so we have Epiphany. So a lot of you may have had some type of epiphany about a situation so let's see what that is about okay so i feel like some dots have been connecting to you about something okay wheel of fortune you're figuring it out at the nick of time so there's something you're figuring out today or this week that is going to like i don't know you're you're going to be seeing something okay very clearly and whatever you're seeing whatever dot you're connecting like i swear you're you're doing it in perfect timing um but what is this <laughs> six of swords reverse so i feel like you either left something behind or you're thinking about leaving somebody or something behind or a way of doing things behind yeah but you made some type of final decision to do what I feel like you're making a decision to either release yourself from something or to not see somebody's perspective on something like you want to go towards something new because I feel like there may have been a situation where you may have been kind of like mm, something where you were ignoring something or something you ignored i feel like you just couldn't ignore it anymore so whatever decision you've made to see things for what they are see a situation for only looking out for their best interests you made this decision um this this epiphany this connection and the right and the right timing okay so i feel like you're the universe is protecting you from whatever this is um i feel like whatever situation you're in or whatever job situation or relationship situation somebody was being really shady and that has to end if they want to to move forward with you if a job wants to move forward with you there or however it resonates they have to end whatever shadiness or you know not paying you enough or whatever this is you're they're gonna have to do that before things start new so i feel like for a lot of you guys this person figures this out by um this month how to make things better over the next five days could be really important um yeah, I feel like they go through some type of tower moment of you kind of like walking away from a situation or walking away and making a decision not to not to see something from somebody's point of view. Page of Swords, I feel like you learn a different perspective. You understand that there's other things going on. There's other ways to do this or other ways to do that. And a lot of, a lot of you are going to have new opportunities, new passion, new love coming towards you, new relationships coming towards you. Um, but it all stems from this, this opportunity and this decision that you make that you're not happy with listening to somebody else's idea or view of things and how things should be you're showing up here as a queen or a king of swords so i do feel like you're setting boundaries with someone somebody does respect you a lot but i feel like um those boundaries that you set especially when it comes to other people involved gossiping um making up rumors three of cups and the reverse energy that's done i feel like you standing your ground and like the queen or king of swords energy cuts off all the like drama all the semantics all the gossip um that kind of thing and i feel like you're just going to focus on going towards what you feel most drawn to if that makes sense um I, <laughs> nine of swords though i feel like yeah i feel like you hmm yeah, I feel like the person or the job or the whatever this is that is in this kind of like, oh, I'm going to look out for myself kind of thing or, oh, I'm only going to listen to my perspective, not collective's perspective. They're going to go through this wave where they're kind of realizing like, wow, they're protecting people or co-workers or friends or family members who um, also only look out for their own better interests, okay? So I feel like this person or this job or this boss or supervisor that you, um, you know, like whatever you're um, connected to, however this resonates, they're having some type of epiphany where they're like, wow, this is like super toxic. This is not what I want to do. And they're going to have this like kind of mode where they're kind of, they kind of think before they do something. 
and they're going to see all the injustices and imbalances in a situation and then try to work with you. So the next two weeks could be really important or the next two days for some of you guys. But I do feel like a lot of you are setting boundaries like immediately when you see that something may not be right or something may be confusing or there may be you know, people just really not seeing things from your perspective or like listening for like what's best for you. They're only advocating for themselves or, you know, you're working a job, for example, that wants you to work, you know, 100 billion hours. But, you know, you have kids at home or, you know what I'm saying? You don't get vacation days or however it resonates. But like you're choosing you and choosing what's best for you. And I feel like the universe is rewarding you for that. This person or this job or whatever, however it resonates, it's going to come back towards you as a, you know, kind of make this um, place more, more reasonable, more honest, more not look out for yourself, more cohesive, uh, that kind of thing. So I feel like in between that time, Continuing to do what's best for you is going to be important, but it feels like you learned, you know, you've had an amazing epiphany and the universe is going to be surrounding you around this great decision. So let's get some advice for the collective. Advice for the collective. All right, so listen to your intuition. I feel like um, this is like a perfect example um, for when this happens or if this happens, if you resonate with this message, um, this is a perfect example of what it looks like and what it feels like to trust your intuition, okay? Um, I feel like you're going to be fine as long as you continue to do that. Um, continue to go towards a new, continue to let people and groups and situations work out their own drama, work out their own situations. Um, anything that doesn't have your best interests in heart or nobody's listening about your, you know, your best interests, the hangman reverse then go towards the new, go towards, you know, a different opportunity. So um, I do hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for hitting the like button, subscribing, and thank you for watching.